To write the number of atoms in Ca3PO42, that's calcium phosphate, let's write down each atom. So we have calcium, phosphorus, and oxygen. So those are the three atoms. For the calcium, there's a three as our subscript, so we have three calcium atoms. For the phosphorus and oxygen, those are in parentheses, so we have to be a little bit careful. When we have parentheses, this subscript out here, we multiply that by everything in the parentheses. The phosphorus doesn't have anything right now. We assume that to be one. So we have one times two. So we have two phosphorus atoms. The oxygen, we have four times two. So that gives us eight oxygen atoms. The total number of atoms in this calcium phosphate compound here would be eight plus two plus three. So that would be 13. If you were asked to figure out how many atoms of, say, phosphorus were in one mole of calcium phosphate, you just multiply this number 2 by Avogadro's number. So you could take 2 times 6.02 times 10 to the 23rd, and this would give you the number of atoms, number of phosphorus atoms, in one mole of calcium phosphate. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.